Hey, Sneaky Lance back for the time being. Now, I was watching a webcast last night, and it seems I've got a convert to Abbey Word. Hey! So let's bring Abbey Word up. We click Abbey Word, and bang. We're there. Look at that. That's one of the reasons why I like using it. Nice and quick. Doesn't look no different from all the others, really. It's just the same, but quicker. And other stuff, like more formats, etc., etc. Okay, we'll go down, open the open Office Writer up. And it ain't too bad on this machine I'm using here. But it is slower. But it's still nice. I mean, I, I do like OpenOffice, but I just have no need for the full suite, personally, because I don't use it all. So it'd be pretty pointless me having it, really. Plus, I, I use a lot of older machines as well, and Abbey Word just flies on them with no problem. So we'll go to Abbey Word's site. Abbey Word, word processing for everybody. And it is. It's been around there for a bloody long while. And you've got the Abbey Word collaborative tools online now as well, so you can like work on documents with people at the same time, so that's brilliant. We're on 286 now, so I'm well lagging behind on this installation on this machine. We'll pop up to Linux Planet, and he's done a little write-up here, old Joe, and basically all what he says is very, very true. It's small, it's fast, it's lean, and if you've got an older machine, even really, 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 really old, we're going back in time here, maybe an original Pentium 1, you'll still be able to get it to work, basically, in the day. Well, like, maybe not as fast as super duper fast, but hey, it will work, and you'll be able to do all your documents. So, that's one reason. So, you get that out of the way, like, oh, ooh, what happened there? Don't want to do that. So, go back to the main page here. I've just done a bit of Take a tour. Okay, we'll take a little tour. And so, I'll click there. Basically, it's multi-platform, and when it says multi-platform, it is for everything. Windows, Mac, and Linux, and BSD, and Unix. It's all available. We've got some screenshots here. Oh. I'll open up screenshots for Windows. There you go. Comes up all nice. You wouldn't know any different, really, would you? But the Mac one. Ooh, that's weird, isn't it? Now, bear in mind that the Abbey Word for Mac lags behind all the others because nobody wants to work on it, I suppose. I don't know. I'm not going to open the GNOME one because I know what it looks like. But I've opened up this one in Yiddish, you know, the one that goes backwards. Look, even there. Super. Works for everybody. That's weird, though, isn't it? I can get over that. Anyway, what else on the website? Right, plugins. You used to have to go and get the plugins yourself, but now you no longer have to, because if you go into your repos, you'll find all the extras and the plugins for Abbey Word there, for Google and everything. This is the matrix for it anyway, you don't have to do it anymore, but you used to have to do it <coughs> back in the day. Anyway, what else we got there? The reviews we've done about Abbey Word, yeah, look, we know all about it, I'll just tell you about it. Abbey Word version 1 was released in 2002, so it's more than 8 years old now, and so it's come on quite nice, really. Come on quite nice. I like it. Yeah. What else to show you? Uh, yeah. Planet Abbey Source. Or oh, Abbey Word, even. That's alright, yeah. Tells you what's going on, and who subscribes to it. Bloody, bloody, blah. Nice if you want to go and look at it. I mean, go and have a look at the site yourself. It's really quite interesting. System requirements. But there you go, look. It'll leave and run on Windows 95 if you've still got something like that. Why would you still have that? I don't know. And all you need is 16 mega RAM. Oh my god, so that's nice and lean and light, isn't it? We're at 245 for Mac OS X, by the way. Or Mac OS X, should I like that? Oh, anyway, that's enough of that, enough of the website. Good boy, then. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to open Abbey Word up. I'm just have a little look around. Most of you should have used this by now, but some of you might not have even heard of it. So anyway, we'll go to about Abbey Word. Got one well lagging on that. It's 2.6.8 on this machine. So that'll be no good, is it? No good for me. I have to get a new one. So, if I go to save as, as you, if you've seen some of my videos, I do this quite a lot. But on the versions I've got, because I've got all the plugins here for this version, and I'll go down Microsoft Word, HTML, MHD, RTF, RTF again, basic text files, encoded text files, pull, pull document format, pass, oh, what the one's that? All the open office stuff, open documents, Unix, Latex, I thought you wore that, K Word as well. Applix Word, Outlook Express, Newsroot Format, so it's all there, all the formats you can save to. Quite a lot, really, isn't it, when you think about it. So, yeah, anyway, we'll go up to File again, and we'll have a little look on the top bar, and go down, there we go, what else we've got? Paste and Format, all the usual stuff you would find in a program like this, really. What more can I say? Everything is there for you to use. It's smaller, lighter, faster. I've never had it crash at all. As you can see, I've got the Theosaurus in there. I've got the Babelfish translation. I can edit stuff via GIMP. I can Google search in it. I can do wikis in it. 
was etc 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 oh mail mergers I forgot about that so yeah, there's loads of nodes in it I'm getting bored now plugin manager you know no point in seeing that really because I've just showed you most of them haven't I I'll start office right though oh, lovely I still do that don't I I don't know why do your tables insert your tables collaborate so just putting your account there and off you go and that's put the documents usual so there no 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 oh yeah fonts look scroll 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 I've got more fonts than you in every word. Look at that, lovely. There's too many, really, when you think about it. Anyway, anyway Abbey Word. Isn't it bloody brilliant? Now, so if you've never tried it before, just go to your repos, download it, it'll take about 20 seconds, install it, and you'll see how quick it is. And if you've got an old machine, and you've not got a writer on it, try this one, you'll love it. That's enough from me. Abbey Word, 10 out of 10 as you go. Sneaky Linux, going out to play. See you later.